Hi everyone, welcome to a new After Effects tutorial. In this tutorial, I will show you how to create this signature animation in After Effects. So let's get started. Okay, first up, let's create a new comb, and I will call this signature. Let's go with full HD resolution and 24 frames per second and 5 second duration. Let's hit OK. Now I have this uh, signature image. You guys can write your signature on your paper and take a screenshot and then import it to After Effects. I will go with this one and let's, let's hit T and it will bring opacity properties and I will take this down. Let's give it 20 and then let's lock this. We don't need to select it and now go to toolbar and select the pen tool and I will trace it like this. I will uh, speed this up process so you guys can save a little bit of time. By the way, I um, I don't use any fill. I only use a stroke with a seven pixel. Okay, perfect. Now, as you can see, we need to adjust it the stroke. So let's call this layer signature, and then let's open this up and go to content, content shape, and shape here is stroke. Set the line cap to round cap and line join to round join. Now here uh, we have this wave option. Basically this will add a noise texture like this. It add a bit of realism like a pen stroke. You guys can uh, play with the wave length. I will increase it so it not intense like before. Something like this. You guys can play with the pace if you want. It will rotate it. Okay, that's perfect. Now we don't need this signature image, so let's so let's hide it. Okay. Now we need to animate it. So let's go to this shape option. Go to add. Here we can add trim path, and let's open this trim path and. Make sure you're in the zero second. Let's create a keyframe for the end and set this value to zero. Now go to five frame forward and set this to maybe something like this 50. Now go to 12 frame and set this to 100. As you can see, it's not that smooth. So let's select these keyframes and press F9 on your keyboard. It will easy ease this keyframe and now go to graph editor. I will use a value graph for this tutorial and here we can set the graph like this. Let's see a preview. Okay, that's perfect. You can also add a roughen edges effect. So go to windows. Effect and preset. Search for rough and edges. And here you can turn it down the border. Also scale. It will add a little bit pixelated stroke. And that's basically the effect. I hope you guys enjoy it. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Have a great day.